Louis Zamperini, Olympic distance runner, war veteran, and Christian evangelist, has lived an eventful life dressed with both successes and struggles. Louis Zamperini was born on January the 26th, 1917, in New York, to Anthony Zamperini and Louise Dossi, who were from Verona, Italy. He grew up in a strict and religious Catholic family. However, he started smoking and drinking at a very young age. During his childhood, he faced bullies and had two near-death experiences. The first incident was when his house caught fire, and the second was when he almost drowned after falling into an oil rig. His brother Pete was a great source of support for him during his later childhood and encouraged him to pursue his career in running. As a troubled youth, he channeled his energy into running, discovering a talent that would shape his future. He ran all summer in 1932, including his first cross-country race. For the next three years in high school, nobody could beat him. He started beating his brother's records. In 1934, he set an interscholastic record for the mile, clocking in at 4 minutes, 21.2 seconds, at the preliminary meeting of the California State Championships. The following week, he won the California State Meet Championships with a time of 4 minutes and 27.8 seconds. That record helped him win a scholarship to the University of Southern California. In 1936, Zamperini decided to try out for the Olympics. In those days, athletes had to pay their way to the Olympic trials. But since his father worked for the railroad, Lewis could get a train ticket free of charge. A group of Torrance merchants raised enough money for the local hero to live on once he got there. Zamperini did not compete in the 1,500 meters. Instead, he ran the 5,000 meters. On one of the hottest days of the year during a deadly heat wave in Randallis Island, New York. Some people collapsed during the race, while 40 people died. However, Zamperini tied with American record holder Don Lash and qualified for the 1936 Summer Olympics in Berlin at 19 years, 178 days, making him the youngest American five, 000 meter qualifier. His journey to success was not without obstacles. During World War II, he served as a bombardier in the Pacific. His plane crashed into the ocean, leaving him stranded at sea for 47 days. Enduring starvation, shark attacks, and relentless sun, he refused to succumb to despair. Instead, he clung to hope and the will to survive. Rescued by Japanese forces, Zamperini's ordeal was far from over. He spent over two years as a prisoner of war, enduring unimaginable torture and deprivation. Yet, he refused to break, drawing strength from memories of his family and his indomitable spirit. After the war, Zamperini faced a new battle, overcoming the scars of his past. Haunted by nightmares and plagued by anger, he struggled to find peace. But through faith and forgiveness, he found redemption. Zamperini's story is one of triumph over adversity. He went on to become a symbol of determination, inspiring countless others to persevere in the face of hardship. His legacy lives on as a reminder that no matter the challenges we face, we have the power to overcome them with courage, perseverance, and faith.